How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to another Shaving with Surge. And I want to thank you guys for joining me on another shave. And today's shave, going to be using that new custom Yuri console razor. This is a 10 8 extra hollow. So it's really cool to have a hollow razor at this size of blade. It's it's my first 10 8 is my favorite size for a straight razor um, so far. And check out that file work, mammoth scales, these beautiful scales, beautiful, beautifully polished, beautiful work. The only issue I had, if you guys watched my unboxing, is that it scrapes. And um, I did reach out to Yuri and he told me that, um, you know, that these scales may have warped or twisted with the humidity or temperature during shipping and that um, it should be an easy fix. He says just adding two washers, which it already has washers in there. I don't know if you can see them. Um, he said that uh, if I could do it myself or I could ship it back to him and he'd do it free of charge. Um, so I'm gonna think about it because shipping to Ukraine is probably gonna be pricey. Um, so I'm gonna put some thought into it, but I do wanna use it. I'm excited to use it, see how it does. I don't know if you could read that. It says, console 10 eights um and all he said all i needed to do was just shrop it so i shropped it gave it 50 laps good to go uh gonna be coming in with the pre-shave paa the cooling splash um singari that's my go-to right now the um aftershave bomb it's gonna be a bowl lather and the soap i got in there is kink kink from first canadian shave and i'm excited man this is only the second time i used them use this soap and i've i've had this since i looked at my youtube video because i um that was the first time i ever used it has haven't used it since i'm finally returning back to some of these soaps that i've only used once and i used this one in july of last year so yeah <laughs> that's you know i only shave two to three times a week so um you know, it's it's hard to return back to soaps when I've been collecting. Oh, I, I love the stink of the kink. It's a nice, masculine, dirty, leather, coffee. That sweet undertone that's like a vanilla, but I would think it's like almost like a caramel-ish. And uh, the slight booze in there. It's just, it's a dirty, masculine, leathery i like the stink of a kink a lot so excited to use look at that label i bought the soap just because of that label man i was like oh i had to get it it was one of my first like under it was probably like somewhere between fifth and in the fifth and tenth soap purchase somewhere around there it was, it was early on but probably more around the fifth purchase um for the brush i'm going to be using the kraken the Kraken for bowl lathers. I've been loving synthetics. I gotta try a badger again in it. Um, haven't ha I just know that I I I do prefer the synthetics, and um, I say I gotta give, I gotta give badger a chance. I think the reason why I, I think the badger I end up that it eats more of the lather for me. I just it's easier for me to dial it in with the synthetic. Um, but I am as gr I'm as novice in, in bowl lathering as can be, in my opinion. All right, so let me lather this up, take off the new shreddy bamboo from Dixon, and I'll be right back. I'm back and just forgot to mention in the beginning of the video, which I wanted to. This is still up for grabs. I'll be announcing the winner tomorrow. If you want to win the Shaving with Surge boozy brush bath coffee mug, just enter I'm in, last chance and I'll be giving this away and shipping it out to whoever wins. So good luck to those who wanted to win it. All right, I'm going to wet the face. Oh yeah. Let's get that pre-shave in. All right, I should get enough. Let me place that in the other sink. Now I get to, let me cover the straight razor. There we go. Let me wet the face, rub it in with the hands. Oh, yeah. 
That cube is no joke. That'll last a lifetime, man. It'll last me a lifetime. <laughs> Can I kill that in a year? <laughs> All right. Uh, dry the hands. Um, I totally forgot to do the louder. Pfft, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Totally forgot to um, make the louder. Scent shrink on this. I give this about a seven and a half. It's a nice, nice scent shrink. Not not weak and not over overbearing or anything. Here we go. Got it nicely whipped up in here, and uh, just work this in. First Canadian shave is one of the, my favorite soaps to use. Always have great shades with that. It. it produces great lather. Ah, the stink of the kink. Well, he's a red eyelid shaver was the first to say that. And uh, this could actually take more water. Oh, blooping, blooping everywhere. Let's just add this back in. And I did switch over to two pass shades. I did like three of them uh, back to back and I did not notice any lip loss in quality of my shave, how smooth my shave was. So two pass shades are the way to go for me. Just uh, against the grain and with the grain. I think one of my videos I said across the grain, but I did the motion of against the grain. You know how it is, just sometimes just a mumble of words, mix up words. All right, I'm good to go. Tons of lather in there. And here we go. Yeah, see it's tight, so I just gotta be careful opening that. And here we go. First use of the Yuri. Got nice balance and weight to it. I gotta get used to it. Ah, to get over here by my ear. There we go. Having a hard time finding that that edge point right there. Just gotta get used to the new razor. Very comfortable edge. Very, very comfortable edge. And let's go to the other side. Okay, so yeah. See, I actually have a hard time using rounded edges like that to find then I do actually like a, a Spanish point or square point. Um, you know, these are used recommended for beginners. Less chances of cutting yourself with those aggressive edges. But I've known that personally. To get close in certain areas, I've always found it a little harder because that round, the blade right here, that's not the cutting edge, sticks out farther than the actual cutting edge. All right. And 
that's gonna be my first pass. And let me, I'm gonna add more water to this. Let me mix this up. I have enough lather in here for three passes. <laughs> there we go. just because I have the lather. See what I mean about this beautiful lather? It's got such a great shine to it. Super slick. Very dense, cushiony. All right. Here we go. Final pass. I need another towel. <laughs> All right. I didn't do laundry. Yeah, ask Yuri what his progression is. I don't even know what stones he uses. Um, my curiosity. Extremely comfortable. to the money pass this will be the real test for me the money pass on my mustache area and i can get my final judgment on the edge beautiful beautiful comfortable sharp Beautiful. So very happy with the edge. Very happy with the scales, the razor. Just that unfortunate of um, the warping or the twisting of the scales from shipment to here. Because Yuri said that um, it wasn't like that. He checked it. He tested it. I believe him, you know. Um, something that unfortunately happened. All right, let me uh, rinse off. I'll be right back. All right, Matt, I'm back. 
did a little touch up, goatee area, a little bit around the lip and nose, just my usual touch up areas that I always have to do. And yeah, beautifully, ah, just BDS, skin smooth, no weepers, beautifully comfortable, sharp edge. Uh, Max's edge is still the sharpest. I still love Max's edge, but this is probably a, uh, Number two, number two, number two favorite edge. That is, this probably would be more preferable of a lot of other people. I think Max's edge is, is um, might be a little aggressive for uh, for some people, but I love it. Going in with that Zingari man, cooling, nice menthol recovery splash it is my go-to now nice cool menthol burn gonna come in with the uh, bomb the thing about the bombs that gets all over the place <sighs> squirts out <laughs> that's what she said oh all right <laughs> And that's it. It's been another video. Thank you guys for joining me. Really happy with this razor. Besides that one issue, once that gets fixed, definitely gonna love this razor. I'm very, very happy with it. It's, that's really nice. And really happy to return back to kink. I love this the first time I used it. Love it still. All right, you guys have a good one.